lubricate the seals before you uh, use them the first time, especially wipe, soap, grease, oil, something that will keep them lubricated. To make it easier attaching the fittings, if you use a uh, crescent wrench, you can use it for a lever and make it a lot easier to attach it. Get the hook on the top hooked first and then the weight of the hose will hold it in place so you can go down below and hook up the other clamp and using the wrench for additional leverage it makes it much easier to hook it up. When you're going down a manhole, the same thing. As long as the top hook's hooked, the hose will stay in place. Once you've hooked up the hoses, before you start the pump, you have to put the front and the rear jack stand down in a way to keep it level and from tipping over. If you don't put the back jack stand down, the weight of the water in the hose would pull the pump uh, back down and could tip it over if it's on a ledge with dirt and actually go down it. Before starting the pump, you check all the valves to make sure they're closed. You check the back flush valve, the drain valve in the front, under the volute, and you make sure the valve that feeds the water to the vacuum pump is open. Just a minute, Boone. Uh, get out. You're in the sh you're shadowing it too much, but put your hand on it. You want to make sure that this valve is open 